Hello there fellow YouTubers, this is Roberto from RA Social Gaming. This time I'll be doing a short preview review of this awesome game that I've just recently found out. It's called Path of Exile. It's let's say the spiritual successor of Diablo 2 for you for you that know this kind of game. This is an RPG kind of dark in this thing. Uh, the main the main story is that you got action you got your character goes into this island uh, exiled called ray class and let's begin the game this is how you get into ray class you actually drift away from a boat here in ray class you actually feel alone it's it's that you can see a fellow exit oh damn uh, this uh, this game has many actual cool things basically one of them is it's not your traditional RPG you actually learn skills through trainer snails you actually learn skills through all these gems uh, each kind of color red gems represent strength attributes green gems represent dexterity attributes and blue gem represent magic attributes so basically if you have gems level up that's an awesome feature actually your skills level up uh, depending on how many times you use them and you could actually in theory if you have all the stats be able to use all skills that's an awesome feature I really like about this game another cool feature it has is the passive skill tree here as you can see I haven't seen this anywhere before any other kind of game you actually have like I think it's like 2000 different passives so in, in conclusion your character won't be the same as mine or anyone else because the amounts of combinations that you can do are are almost infinite here depending on your character here is where you start depending on on other kind of target those other characters start here so you basically each of the cards to start are at different points in the game here in ray class you can see it's a very dark atmosphere so here you can see zombies and those crap things right there uh, as I told you before the skill system uh, I found it very interesting uh, use pots like in Diablo 2 is it's very traditional thing for RPGs uh, I have played through the I have played through the first walkthrough the difficulty of, of the game is actually very good it's not easy but it's not hard until after you finish the first playthrough of the game then it gets a little bit more harder uh, another cool feature that I found out about the game is that you don't actually it doesn't have any currency based games such as gold silver, or anything else you actually have to barter for things it does complement the ambience of you being exiled into this land and guys I really recommend for you that are watching this video I really recommend you to download this game I'll leave you the link for the game below on the comment area uh, this game is actually on beta but in my opinion it's, it's a really complete game the the game experience is practically complete I could say it's a it's a it's a complete game though it gets patched uh, every week uh, I do agree that this game is like the spiritual successor of Diablo 2 it does have the ambience of that great game uh, uh, so what else guys uh, if you actually like the game and download it uh, leave your comment below I can be your mentor I can, hel I can help you through the game <laughs> I can maybe actually help you a little bit quick leveling <laughs> if I like you and guys remember to like share subscribe this game and I have a last question for you the one should do if you are actually if you have actually played Diablo, th Diablo 3 before and this game what game do you actually do you actually feel is better leave your comment below and thank you take care